What's up everybody? In this video, I'm going to show you three free mint NFT projects that I'm keeping my eye on. I'm not sure exactly how they're going to do. It's very hard to predict and I'm not even sure who is behind those projects. So always do your own research, but I'm going to keep my eye on them and I'm going to try to get a whitelist spot. But before I'm going to show you the projects, a couple of things I wanted to state. I'm not a financial advisor. This is not a financial advice. This video is for educational and entertainment purpose only. Always do your own research before investing any money into NFT projects. And then another thing, while back or maybe a couple of weeks ago, I made a video about free mint NFT projects and I talked about Terrapin Genesis. They were minting today. And if you were able to get yourself a whitelist spot for this project, let's look at the open sea. As you can see currently, the floor price is 0.081. I think the highest I seen it was 10%. This is literally free 8% of Ethereum. And let's open it up. Let's see how much is going to be in dollars. It's $121 for free. You only would have to pay for gas fee when you were minting. And I think the mint was around six, seven, eight bucks. Depends what time you were minting, depends on the like way. So if you were able to get yourself a whitelist spot for Terrap and Genesis, then this was a win for you. So now let's look at the free mint NFT projects that I'm keeping my eye on. So this one, first one, and most of the projects are very early. So you still have time to get a whitelist spot. So the first one called is Serendipia Free Mint. There's not a whole lot of information about this project, but if we scroll down, they have a premium link that was posted a couple months ago. It got decent interaction, so I'm not entirely sure how this project is going to do, but kind of interesting art looks like a painting. So this is one of them that I'm keeping my eye on. Don't really know how much about this project. Then the second, it's called Carrot Punks Free Mint. It's a low supply. Keep your notifications on. Most likely they're going to be dropping something. I'm not even sure, but if you're going to try to get a whitelist spot for the projects that I'm talking about, I would always recommend keeping notifications on. They have premium link. And then if we scroll down, as you can see, this one is getting actually a lot more interaction like this one it has 4,500 likes and 4,500 retweets, but it's due to premium link. This is part of the requirements that you have to do before you can register to premium. But this is another one that I'm keeping my eye on, most likely for a quick flip. And since it's the low supply, maybe they're gonna do well on secondary market. And then the last project, it's called Cut Them, and looks like this is play to earn. They already have a link tree and they have a website and it's a free mint. And if we scroll down, as you can see, this one also getting quite a bit of interaction. They also have a discord so you can join their discord, see if they are doing any giveaways on their discord, or you can just follow them on Twitter, participate in any of their giveaways on Twitter, or maybe collabs that they're doing with a different NFT projects or alpha groups. And then if we go to their website, website actually looks pretty cool. There is a couple things. This is all of their social media and looks like this is get book so you can probably get more information about this project mint roadmap team and hq so i'm assuming headquarters and if we scroll down as you can see most likely this is going to be some kind of metaverse game or something like that and then you can actually play demo here so if you're into it and not just for flipping then you can probably play and see what kind of game is that and as you can see we we scroll down more the actual website looks pretty cool the way they design everything and everything else on their website. So this is three free mint NFT projects that I'm keeping my eye on and I'm going to try to get a whitelist spot for all three of them. And if they're going to do well, once they're going to start mint, of course, I'm going to be keep watching on OpenSea. And if they're going to do well, I'm going to buy and most likely I'm going to flip them. And this is pretty much it. All the projects that I talk about, I'm going to leave links in the description below. And if this video is helpful to you, press that like button and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.